corporate career, I set this company Flipping X, so I'm a creative media consultant now. So I don't work with producers, I work with brands, I work with broadcasting platforms, anything to do with the content universe as well. I wanted to do it in a creative environment, and I didn't think you could do an MBA in a creative environment until I saw uh, this one advertised here. And the great thing about this MBA, obviously it's a master of business administration course that um, it's really full of creative innovation. So we work with, we do three major projects. Uh, the previous co have worked with companies like Louis Vuitton, designing their store of the future. Um, we're currently working with London Ambulance Service to see how we can improve them. So next time I get to go on an ambulance at night, so that'd be great. Um, which I love is how does creative innovation become the biggest differentiator? as we move forward into the future. So obviously everyone talks about technology and technology just increase, 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 but my belief is creativity the biggest differentiator. That's what's going to make a brand, may make your life different from others. And that's why I'm passionately involved now. Um, and I thought this place is the place to come and do that. So, yeah. You'll get a free when we get the money. It's 13pm and still getting 11, 12 minutes. I feel so scared. How am I going to survive? Oh my god! This is the most challenging thing I've ever put myself up for. Get ready for the ultimate summer of love. What does creative consulting involve? What does it involve? Yeah. So, a typical, I get kind of three typical work streams of company. I get producers who have been developing. Uh, some content, uh, some, they call it a development slate. So often, most producers will be working on five or six projects and they'll develop it up before they go to pitch it to a broadcaster or a platform owner. Uh, and what they do is they'll come to me, hopefully they'll come to me, I'll get to them, uh, and they'll ask me what my view is of that project and what do I think, given my experience, it could be different, what could be improved before they take to pitch it. Some people ask me to help them write a pitch document because, bizarrely, some creative people are very creative writing a story. When they come to sell that story to somebody else, they're rubbish. Yeah, I don't know why they are. So I help them create that. Um, and then I also work with some brands who are trying to unlock, I guess, brand messages beyond pure advertising. And they're trying to work out how does content, a bit like that, the always example, how can you make something that still got branding on it, but is a real story that gives some relevance to the brand, but people buy into it generally. I think part of, you know, having had a, been lucky enough to have an experience in this business is I generally want to give something back, and one of the other things I, I want to do post one day is to teach a bit more as well.